Shalom, everybody. So here we are in my wife's village down here in Amiri. Yes. You know, village area, very peaceful and beautiful. You know, peace so, of mind. <laughs> <laughs> Shalom, everybody. So, my sweet. Yes. How has it been, you know, staying in the rural area of Nigeria? I love it. You know. Which one do you prefer? The village? That is the countryside, which mm -hmm. is where we are right now. Yes. We're taking um, a look at... This is my village, actually. So, this is my village. And... Um, yeah. Turn it around let them see the beautiful... Like the... Okay. Here is... This is how it is. This is somebody's house. We're walking past. Yep. And you can see... This is the vicinity. Yes. Like that. We are walking home. See from behind us. So as I was asking earlier, living in a countryside, mm -hmm. which is what I love, <laughs> mm -hmm. and living in the city, you know, where everybody's hustling and making quick money, which do you prefer and why? I prefer the village area because for for one, it's more peaceful. Mm -hmm. um, it's not so crowded, you mm -hmm. know. And of course, it's beautiful. It's more scenery, you know. And this is also where, like, I prefer because I'm like a country man. I grew up in the country. And then I want to do things like farming, farming and stuff like that. So this is the ideal place for me as far as, as I want to live. Not like a hustle and bustle place. Yes. Where you don't have so much peace and it's a lot of noise. Yes. And as you can see, we're walking past people's homes. These are people's homes. People live there and everybody is at peace. Everybody's comforted. You can see over there. Over there you can see people's clothes. They washed clothes. You can even see some little children over there. And we're walking home right now. So, my sweet, as, we, as I was asking you, mm -hmm. is this place safe, Adia? You walk through the bushes. <laughs> <laughs> to the, yeah, some people will be asking you to want to know. Mm -hmm. Just as they can see, we're walking huh. home. We went to go and see somebody. And we're walking home. Do you think this place is safe? Are you afraid that they might kidnap you or some animal, <laughs> <laughs> snake or something? Can you know? It's it's just as safe as you was at home in the the country. You know, the rural side in the U.S. So it's very safe around here. You know. Um, not too much going on as far as like animals it's not like no wild crazy animals running around here like lions and tigers and you know what I'm saying elephants I think a lot of people think that <laughs> Africa is you, you're in a jungle <laughs> no, you see <laughs> you see animals everywhere I took mm -hmm. a picture of you and a dog you yeah. were playing with it right. you know. so if we can go in the woods over there uh -huh. and run the run around in the wilderness, like not and not being afraid of being attacked by some wild animal, uh -huh. we can do the same here. It's no difference um, because in these, you know, build up uh, town area, city area, village areas, you know, there's not a lot of wild animals running around like lions, tigers, and elephants and zebras. Um, I don't know why people got a fear of that. You know, in America, we got a lot of dangerous animals. Bears. These are people's Ooh. homes. Mm -hmm. As you can see behind us, you can see people's homes. And every home, this is another home over there. This is another one over there. Everybody has a garden. Everybody has a farm. Everybody has a piece of land. And they farm on. And um, when we talked to Chief, Chief said, there are so many lands here. And if you want to come back, coming back is your, as in your people over there, that is your decision to make. But when you return here, you have peace because you can be adopted by a family. You can be, you know, accepted into a home. They will give you a land. They will give you places to build where you want to be and start up somewhere, you know. So what about some of other people that you've met? You know in the village how has they been receptive to you very very receptive you know they're nice they speak to me it's just like any other place if did you they... feel different like you are a stranger or you felt like you were one of them i felt like i was one of them i felt at home 
you know um just like any other place you go somewhere different the people might know you're not from that particular neighborhood so they might look at you but you speak you say hi you speak and you say hi thank you you speak you say hi you make friends with the people you know and you accept it like anywhere else unless you just acting strange and odd and make them want to run away from you 